Now that we're approaching Yom Kippur, after having a meaningful Rosh Hashanah, let's focus on the theme of Yom Kippur, which is forgiveness. God is forgiving us. He wants to forgive us. He invented Yom Kippur as an occasion for forgiveness. But there are two kinds of forgiveness. There's the forgiveness that comes as a relief. You did something terrible to me. I'm angry at you. I resent you. I don't want to hear from you. I may even want to take revenge. But then you come and you ask for forgiveness. I like that. Because now I can forgive you and get you out of my life. I don't want to walk around for a long time angry at you, burdened with this. Yes, yeah, I forgive you. Of course I forgive you. Because I want you out of my life. So, in fact, there is forgiveness. It's not the kind of forgiveness we want from God. There's another kind of forgiveness. And that is where you do something to harm me, you hurt me, you get me really angry. I don't want to hear from you. You're, I'm finished with you. You're out of my life. Get lost. And then you come and ask for forgiveness. And I'm surprised. You got to me. Your request for forgiveness, your apology, touched me. I never thought anything you say would ever me be meaningful to me again. So to my own surprise, you got to me. And yes, I forgive you. I forgive you in response to what you said and what you asked for. So now you're not only forgiven, you are welcome back into my life. I realize I don't want you to disappear. I don't want you to go away. Despite everything, I want you in my life. That's what we mean on Yom Kippur when we say, God, forgive us in response to our request. Solachti kidvorecha. I am forgiving you in response to you, not in rejection of you. And that's the kind of forgiveness God wants to give us. So if we show up in the shul on Yom Kippur, he has the opportunity to offer that forgiveness. Welcome back. I never wanted to get rid of you.